America's labor laws haven't been substantially updated since the 1940s. That's why it's time for the Employee Rights Act, legislation that will update American labor law for the 21st century. What does the ERA do? The proposed law contains eight provisions that shift power away from union officials and transfer it to employees. It would ensure that employees could decide if they want union representation, free from coercion and intimidation, keeping workplaces democratic. Three of the most important provisions are guaranteed secret ballot union elections, periodic unionization revotes, and stopping unapproved political spending of union dues. When deciding on whether or not to join a union, the ERA would guarantee employees have their right to a federally supervised secret ballot election. As it stands now, union bosses can bypass secret ballot elections and instead use publicly signed employee agreements. These pressure tactics to sign away individual rights leave employees vulnerable to bullying and threats, tactics often used to pressure employees into joining unions. The ERA would also require that unionized workplaces have a supervised secret ballot election after substantial employee turnover. This second vote would determine whether employees still support the union that is collecting their dues. Less than 10% of employees ever voted for the union currently in their workplace. Union bosses and mandatory dues are rarely put up for a re-vote. Under current law, most union members must continue to pay union dues to keep their jobs. Their dues provide millions of dollars that are spent by union bosses to maintain a steady financial stream that funds left-wing political crusades. From 2012 to 2015, labor unions sent $530 million in union dues to liberal special interest groups, even though about 40% of union household members vote Republican. The ERA would require labor officials to first get permission from employees before spending their dues dollars on politics. It's no wonder that Congress and 80% of Americans, including union household members, support the Employee Rights Act. To see all of the ERA's provisions, visit EmployeeRightsAct.com.